Hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Box Bricks with Bruce. Today we're going to be opening up 24 retail packs of 2011-12 Upper Deck Series 1. These were all liberated from the old blister packs, I believe they came 3 to a uh, blister pack. Again, stated odds mean absolutely nothing when it comes out of blister packs, because the collation of those was generally god-awful. Um, if you remember, I opened up those 108 packs of Black Diamond a week or so ago. Those also came from blister packs, and frankly, we crushed the odds on uh, whatever is stated on the back of them, and those came from a sealed case. So today, we're going to be busting 24 packs of that, as well as another pack of uh, 02, oh, sorry, 0102 Bat Signature Series. So really, we're on the hunt for young guns this time. Um, your big two names out of Series 1, I believe, are Gabriel Landeskog and Ryan Nugent Hopkins, which neither of which I can really complain about if I end up pulling. And as for what other inserts are there, we could potentially pull Hockey Heroes cards, we can pull Canvas Young Guns, we can pull Canvas Regular Cards, Header Cards, Painted Cards, Jerseys, All World Team. So there's still potential for hits. It's not just... Uh, not just crappy retail, there's potential for some interesting stuff. But, let's stop wasting time with talking. Let's get down to breaking. And of course, Urbe Bobblehead of Judgment is here. And uh, he's ready to judge. Andreas Nuttall. Jay Boomister, Joe Thornton, and we're starting off with Young Guns Rookie, we'll save it for the last card, Marc-Andre Fleury, P.A. Parento, Chris Letang, just mowing over the goalie, I love it, <laughs> and uh, Keith Yandel, and we have our Young Guns Rookie of Jonathan Blum. Urbe's verdict on Jonathan Blum. No, um, it's, it's a young gun from a retail pack in our first one, no less. Definitely a lot better names to be had. But, we got a long way to go with our breaks. This is only pack one. Next up, Alexander Semen. Justin Williams. Ryan Whitney. John Tavares. Kyle Ocposo, Zdeno Chara, San Gagne. Remember, he got eight points in a game with the Oilers, then five the next game. So he was one of the closest in recent memory to almost almost get to Daryl Sittler's single game record of ten. So that's pretty cool. And of course, we have Young Guns rookie, another one, two for two so far. Carl Klingberg. Urbe says, eh, it's all right. Winnipeg Jets rookies from the earliest days of the current Jets can't complain. Of course, can be better players, but uh, eh. can be a lot worse as well. Best way to, to look at it. Ryan Klo, Nathan Gerby, Christian Husalius, Brian Gionta. Try and get through the base a little bit quicker. I don't want to make another half hour video. America Zedlitschke. Jason Spezza, Dave Boland, and we have Canvas, just regular Canvas, not a rookie, uh, Vinny LaCavalier. Um, Urbe will not be judging that, it's just a Canvas card. Clark MacArthur, Dan Boyle, Stephen Weiss, Mark Stahl, Stephen Stamkos, and we have Upper Deck Game Jersey of Chris Stewart. Urbe's verdict. No. Um, it's cool to get a game jersey always out of these blister pack stuff, but uh, definitely a lot better names to be had. James Reimer. Lubomir Vizhnovsky. Drew Doughty. Steve Ott. Chris Stewart, David Perron, Cam Ward, and 1950s hockey heroes, Johnny Busick. 
Again, Urbe is not judging that one because it's just the just your old regular card there. Okay. Pierre Marc Bouchard, Rene Bork, Evgeny Dadanov, Mark Giordano, Mika Kiprasov, Ryan Callahan, checklist of Milan Lucic, Tim Thomas, and Zdeno Chara. And we have another Young Guns rookie, so far three of Alex Stalock. That he is a goalie and currently in the NHL, Urbe says, yes, I approve of almost any good goalie hit out there. Is it the most valuable in the set? No. Let us continue. Okay. Cal Clutterbuck. Toimo Rutu. Dustin Bufflin. Contract terminated by Jets recently. Jay McClement. Duncan Keith. Daniel Sedin. Cam Fowler. And Hockey Heroes of Terry Sawchuk. Alright. And our last card of pile number one. Daniel Breer. Josh Bailey. Rob Scuderi. Lori Korpikowski. Guillaume de Tendresse. Patrice Cormier. Remember him? <laughs> Jason Pominville. And All World Team insert of Nicholas. Backstrom. Alright. On to pile number two. Tim Thomas. Eric Stahl. Michael Grabner. Drew Stafford. I don't think we've had a single base only pack yet. That's pretty cool. Marion Hosa. Nathan Horton. Yoni Pitkinen. And Canvas regular of UC Jokinen. I'll be honest, I was worried this was going to be like all base packs with like one or two some things that sprinkled in. Well, speak of the devil, all base pack. <laughs> I'm not even going to bother. This one's an all base pack. Yeah. No. All base. Mike Knubel. As I've made the joke before, you can never mispronounce his name. If you say the K loud, you say the K quiet, either way it sounds the same. You go Mike Knubel or Mike Knubel. <laughs> uh, Nick Foligno. I entertain even myself sometimes. Alexander Steen. Cal Clutterbuck. Nikolai Kullerman. Nick Schultz. Matt Stajan. And we have canvas younger guns of Matt Fratton. So another Young Guns. Urbe's verdict? No. Um, better Young Guns to be had. It is a good team. Toronto being quite sought after, but Fratton uh, definitely didn't pan out at all. Up next, Brent Seabrook, Darren Helm, David Krejci, Redim Verbata, Martin St. Louis, Mark Giordano, Mika Kiprasov, and we have another Young Guns rookie of Eric Condra. Eric Condra. Urbe says, no, um, definitely one of the weaker rookies <laughs> from that class. Especially in retrospect, even with it being a Canadian team. All right, next up. Next up, Pierre-Marc Bouchard, Rene Bork, Yevgeny Dodonov, Danny Briere. Ryan Callahan, the checklist once again of Lucic, Thomas, and Chara, Gilom El Tondres, and we have all world team insert of Yaroslav Halak. Alright, almost done our second pile. Um, Eric Stahl, Michael Grabner, everything in every which way, Drew Stafford, once again, Mike Knubel, or Knubel, Yoni Pitkinen, Braden Coburn, Nikolai Kuleman, and Antti Niemi, all world team. He kind of came and went very fast, won his Stanley Cup in his rookie year, led the Hawks to it, and then that's it. Never really amounted to the same success ever again. Justin Williams, the man of many cup finals. Ryan Whitney, 
Tim Thomas, Zdeno Chara, Sam Gagne, identical packs as before here, uh, Marian Hossa, Nathan Horton, and we have another Young Guns rookie of Jonathan Blum. Again, why can't it be two Landis Cogs or two uh, Ryan Nugent Hopkins? Urbe says no. Um, we said no before. We say no now. Again, we're doing well in the fact that we're getting so many young guns, but the names eh, could definitely be better for us. Okay, this one is an all base pack. We'll move on to the next. Nathan Gerby, Christian Huselius, Brian Gianta, Phil Kessel, Jason Spezza, Dave Boland, Ryan O'Burn, and all world team insert of Duncan Keith. All right, down to our last seven packs of this, and then we'll wrap it up with our signature series at the very, very end. Mike Knubel, Nick Foligno, Alexander Steen, Cal Clutterbuck, Nick Schultz, Matt Stajan, Mike Fisher, and regular canvas of Jimmy Howard. This one is an all base pack, we will move on to the next. <clears throat> Mike Santarelli, Alex Edler, Drew McGinla, Ryan Kessler, Corey Perry, David Clarkson, Pekka Rine, and we have Young Guns rookie of Sean Couturier. It's definitely one of the stronger ones from Series 1. Urbe's verdict. Urbe says yes. Couturier is a strong one. Not as strong as your Nuge or your uh, Landis Cog, but definitely not one to complain about. Definitely a step up from Jonathan Blum. Blake Como, Ryan Malone, Nicholas Lidstrom, Alexander Semin, Alex Goligoski, John Tavares, Kyle Ocposo, and regular canvas of Patrick Berglund. All right, down to our last three of that. Blake Como. It's a mirror pack. Ryan Malone, Nicholas Lidstrom. Oh, there we go, it's different now. Corey Schneider, Brendan Morrow, Alex Goligoski, John Tavares, and we have ultimate team insert of Taylor Hall. Former first overall pick of the Edmonton Oilers. Now stuck in Arizona. Michael Neuverth, Patrick Sharp, Magnus Pajarvi. Oh boy, was he uh, a real dud in the NHL after that rookie year he had. So it happens, though you never know. Pekarine, Derek Broussard, Alex Ovechkin, Timo Timonen. And got another Young Guns rookie of Jake Gardiner. Urbe says it's okay. Um, Maple Leafs and he's still in the NHL. A quote unquote defenseman for the Carolina Hurricanes right now, but uh, yeah. Yeah, that's an anticlimactic end to this box here. All base pack. And finally, we move on to our BAP Signature Series to wrap up today's Box Breaker series. Okay, we have Brent Johnson, base. <laughs> I was just talking about this goalie today uh, for my Goalie Museum's social media post for Forgotten Gems, which I do every Saturday. Milan Hanilichka, our Forgotten Gem for today. Very fitting, I like it. Kevin Weeks. Then we have, he shoots, he scores, two point insert of Jerome Aginla. And then finally we have a gold version back signature of Ottawa Senator Magnus Arvidsson. Urbe's verdict. No, um, 
There's way better names to be had in Signature Series Gold or not. Arvidsson is uh, not the best. Plus, it has a ding on the corner, and uh, that always takes away points for me. Okay, so let's do a quick recap of the things that we got today. So we ended up with four regular canvas cards. No superstar names in there. They're just nice. Ended up with two uh, Hockey Heroes cards. Ended up with four of the All-World Team cards of Backstrom, Halak, Niemi, and Keith. Then we got a game jersey of Chris Stewart. And then finally, we ended up with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight Young Guns cards of Gardiner, Couturier, Jonathan Blum times two, Eric Condra, Fratten Canvas, Stalock, and Carl Klingberg. So, we got eight Young Guns for less than the price of a retail box of 2011-12 uh, Upper Deck Series 1 with a few decent rookies in there. Not great ones, but decent ones. Survey's final verdict on our 11-12 Series 1 retail pack breaks for today. It's alright. Again, eight Young Guns, plenty of inserts, only three base packs. However, the names could have certainly been better. So I thank you for coming on by and watching me break some packs. Come back tomorrow, we will have another box for our breaking amusement. Until next time, have yourself an excellent day. Bye bye.